We have two teams that have a rich history together dating back over 70 years. Today, Pitt comes to Durham playing their first ever ACC road game, while the Duke Blue Devils look to show the Panthers a little Southern hospitality. Play action for Savage, who's back to throw. Has a man open that street. Handoff, Connor. Connor, first down, touchdown. Touchdown. Pitt. Touchdown for Pitt. Gannett fires. Pass is taken away. Intercepted and taken down by Jason Hendricks. And Pitt gets a turnover. And they'll bring it back to the Duke 41 yard line for him. That's his eighth career interception. Jalay Duncan gets the fake. Connect gets the throw. The pass looks like it's picked off again. And making the interception is Cameron Williams. See, the ball's going to be thrown just a tad behind and opens the door for the corner to slide to the inside. That ball's got to be thrown out in front of Jamison Crowder towards the sideline. Boyd is in at a, is right beside him as a back. He'll get out into the pattern on second and short. He gets the ball. Nice move by Boyd. Gets the first down. Tripped up and into the end zone. Identify the playmakers. Yeah, it's about making plays in the open field, and this is what they want to do with Tyler Boyd. Now, you've got to make the tackle. C.J. France is going to get isolated on the wide receiver. Right here, number 54 misses the tackle. Now, a little stutter step fake, and he runs by Young Wiseman. And now it's the great speed, the explosion we talked about in the opening. He's just a dynamic player, a freshman out of Clareton, PA. And that on second and ten. Oh, and both the quarterback and the man he handed off to yeah, are tackled who? by Donald. Guess who? <laughs> this is what we saw. We had uh, had a chance to watch Pitt last week, and this is this is who he is. Defeats the down block. They were trying to cut him off. Tackled the quarterback. And the back. I got and you, not, and I got you. Yeah, we're not sure who has it. Just tackled the entire backfield. Does that count as two tackles? Yeah, that's a good idea. Okay. Loss two tackles for loss right there. Savage to throw. Over the middle, has street complete. Street in a foot race, and he's going to get to the end zone. Touchdown, Pitt. Well, Pitt's gotten 161 yards on first down of their 238 they have for the game. He's doing an outstanding job of winning on first down. Savage back to throw. Has a man out there wide open. It's Boyd. And Boyd is headed for a touchdown. Tyler Boyd, true freshman. But when you commit enough, enough resources to the line of scrimmage to stop the run, you're going to get players in behind. Again, the play fake, a lot of players up around the line of scrimmage. Norman, Dwayne Norman, the safety, allows Tyler Boyd to run right by him. Excellent throw from Tom Savage. Just put some air under it, let his talented freshman run and go get it. Funette back to throw. Chased and sacked in the backfield. And that is Aaron Donner. Connor again. Connor gets by the block and gets into open territory one more time, and he may be headed. Cockrell is the saving tackle at the 21 of Duke. Third down and nine, Savage to throw. Has time, looks and gets Weatherspoon. Weatherspoon, another Clareton veteran. 29 seconds left to go. Savage with time again, pass into the end zone, touchdown the board. Tyler Boyd with his third touchdown of the day. Street and Weatherspoon are split to one side. They're looking for Street, and he makes the catch. Touchdown, Pitt. Boy, what an unbelievable, what a great matchup. Russ Cockrell, the big-time corner, is going to come up and play bump and run against Devin Street. It's just the fade route. This is a one-on-one. -on -one. You see Weissman coming, Weissman Young coming on the... Uh, or the young Weissman coming on the blitz. Excellent job of catching over the shoulder. What a perfect throw from Tom Savage. Look how close Lock Cockrell is on coverage, but the ball dropped in perfectly as he breaks the plane of the goal line with the ball. Pittsburgh's kept uh, some of the defensive players out on the field and think there's a fake here. You got Juwan Thompson up on the short area. Here comes. 
Oh, here comes the pass, and it's going to be flattened for a loss on the play. Thomas making the tackle. Again, the pass complete to sink. Two weeks in a row for Todd Thomas on special teams. A lot of window dressing going on by the punt unit to try to maybe get Pitt to jump offside. Ultimately, they decide to fake it. They're going to throw it out the backside of number eight. Todd Thomas, who made the play last week on punt team, makes it again. What a nice play. They need the four for the first down. They got it. They got a touchdown. That's to the tight end. It looks like Orndorff. Had a touchdown last week against New Mexico. And gets one in conference play and gets pipped to 50 points. On third down. Connect throws. Intercepted. Intercepted by Gonzalez. He runs into the end zone. Touchdown pit. Change. Well, Connett's battled all day long, but ultimately he's an inexperienced passer still trying to learn the game. Good trying to throw a little pop pass to Snead over the ball and just never picked up the linebacker who's in that check down area. Gonzalez squeezes it and a pretty easy waltz into the end zone right there. Weatherspoon is in the slot to the top. Here's the pass. It's out there. It is caught by Weatherspoon, but was he inbounds? Yes. They say he's inbounds at the 26, a 24-yard line of Duke. Boy, what a great catch. Witherspoon gets isolated on the safety. Cash. Oh, boy. Oh, looked like he got them both down. One, two. Yep. That one's good at the next level. And he catched it. He controlled it all the way through the ground. The ball did not come out. What a play by Witherspoon. And how about Tom Savage today with six touchdown passes, and that'll do it. It has run out the clock successfully. That's a big few across the windshield. And Pitt pulls off the win here by a final score of 58 to 55.